Good evening and happy 4th of July. <clears throat> Welcome to a update from Johnny's Trains. Pretty brief one. Um, I've been busy with a lot of other things and I haven't been investing too much in the layout. So uh, this is going to be a pretty minor update here. Um, I picked this guy up uh, from my local train vendor about uh, oh, a couple weeks ago. This is a guy floating in the in the pond here, so I put him in today. You can see his trousers and gear right there, sitting on the shore waiting for him to come back. Pretty cool. Um, <clears throat> another figurine I added was right there in the uh, this guy right there. I tried to put him in front of the movie theater, but he wouldn't stick, and that's because I have like that gravelly type stuff all over the place, so I had nothing really to bite onto. So, put that guy in, the guy in the pond, and there was one more guy that I set somewhere. I think I put him over uh, by the train station over there. Uh, other updates, uh, my SD40-2 right here. Um, the rear truck had seized. And uh, I pulled that apart this morning to figure out what was going on. And it just turns out that probably a piece of ballast or something got stuck in the gears. What I did is, I, I mean, I couldn't see it, but I, I just noticed the back truck, the wheels were like lock solid. So what I did is, <clears throat> with my fingers, you can see that there's the can motor right here with the flywheel. I just rocked that back and forth and back and forth and then it started to loosen up. And then I was able to spin it completely 100, 360 degrees around. So I just kept doing that over and over until it got smooth. Uh, and then I brought it out uh, for a test and it worked. Um, I think it needs some more running time. There's Whatever it is, it's almost worked itself through. <clears throat> I really like this engine and I was really bummed. I mean, I had it lashed up with my Dash 9, which is over there at the moment. Um, and the Dash 9 was basically pushing it around the track, or at least pushing half of it around the track, because the truck, uh, it was only the rear truck that was seized. So we got that going. Um, really, I haven't done it today. I, I cleaned all the tracks. Basically, maintenance day. You know, a little rubbing alcohol and... Uh, the rag went through everything, and uh, hopefully everything's going to run nice and smooth. So, wish I had more time to spend on uh, on the layout, but it's just summer is always a busy time of year when you got a four-year-old, four and a half-year-old. So, uh, oh, that's where I put the other guy. He's a brakeman, but you know I put him in front of the bait and tackle tackle shop. So let's fire this guy up here. I got to. Uh, See here, do, 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 do. scroll SP twenty one. All right, let's see how she runs. Pretty good. Tell you what, I wouldn't do that earlier. A little bit of a stutter, but that's more to do with probably a little loss of electrical connectivity between both those switches. That is not uncommon, so I'm not going to worry about it. Okay. Go to old reliable here. I keep this on the layout a lot. It's hard to take it off. It's uh, a. It takes up a lot of space and storage, and it also has a lot of character. And overall, I enjoy running it. So, you've seen this engine a million times. It's just. Still 
run the sound car. Cheap rock car, less relatively new. Got our closed hoppers. Tank cars. Of course, my UP caboose I got a little while back. Uh-oh. Looks like it stopped again. Hmm, I wonder what we got going on here. Yeah, there's something jammed up in there. Yeah, something's definitely jammed. I'm gonna have to take that guy apart some more. Figure out just uh, what's going on there. Oh well, not a uh, entirely successful update for Johnny's trains, but uh, an update nonetheless. Looks like I got some work to do, guys. Okay, hope you're enjoying your Fourth of July, and uh, thanks to all the veterans out there for preserving our freedoms that we enjoy daily. Alright, take care everybody. Good night.